Working in teams allows students to share experiences and consider different points of view and solutions to problems. Collaborative learning teams are formed when there is the potential for learning to be enhanced by the structure, particularly when investigating new ideas and phenomena. The teacher assigns the teams and each student has their own role with its own tasks and responsibilities. In foundation to year two, two roles are used, manager and speaker. In years three to six, three roles are used, manager, speaker and director. I'm the manager and it's my job to get all the equipment for the group. The manager is responsible for collecting and returning the resources the team needs. All of the team are responsible for packing up, not just the manager. I'm the speaker and I have to go to the teacher or other speakers in other teams to ask them for help. It's the speaker's responsibility to seek clarification about the task, either by asking another team's speaker or the teacher. All members of the team are expected to answer questions about the investigation, not just the speaker. I'm the director making sure the team understands what their job is. The director is responsible for making sure the team understands and completes each step of the investigation. The director provides guidance, but is not a team leader. Coloured pegs, stickers, name labels or wristbands are all strategies that can be used to identify which student is assigned to each team role. To help students develop their collaborative learning skills, five team skills should be displayed and practiced. These skills are move into your teams quickly and quietly, speak softly, stay with your team, take turns and perform your role.